Give me some black market music, man. Let's get it, man. And you know what that means. My, my whip, my whip game, come on. Go crazy. See the wrist? Come on, look at the wrist. In the kitchen what cooking that chicken. That means the black market is open. That means oh. that it's some black money to be made, spent, and cycled back through the black community. You know what I'm saying? Because oh. I'm tired of people complaining about what they don't have. But they don't never tell you about what they don't do. Mm, that's a fact. And that's why we bringing this whole black market thing back together, because it's, it's some doers, and we know some people who do. And we know some people who know how to. And we know some people who having things because of the things that, that they, they do. That they know how to do. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. That's facts. And that's why I got my young dog in here with me today. I knew he was a young dog, because he had an old nigga name. <laughs> Yeah. What's his name? You don't get to meet no young nigga named Leander. <laughs> <laughs> that means he come from a good generation where the men stuck around. Right, right. Go back six, seven granddaddies. They all stayed and raised right. the family. Ain't no, you don't get no name Leander being on no bullshit. No. That's a legacy name. No. That come from your great, great, great grandfather. <laughs> And his name be some crazy shit, <laughs> Axelrod or some shit. <laughs> <laughs> no, dead, man, man, there's a lot of people out here who try, you know, continue to climb that ladder of success. And yep. everybody knows, man, you only as good as your resume. Come on. And, and, and my dog Leander, yeah. he got a whole business to show you how to put your resume together. So welcome to the black market, my nah, man. Nah, man, appreciate you, man. Leander Howard. The second. Appreciate it, man. Yeah. I appreciate that. Give him a brief intro of who you are and what you do, man. Yeah, man. So my name is Leander Howard the second. Founder Don't try to say it fast. This is Leander. <laughs> Leander. Leander Howard the uh, second. Founder and CEO of Spark Your Resume. So we're a professional development agency, man. Connecting top talent to top companies. We help people land their dream job in 90 days or less. Yeah. What's a dream job? And it really depends on the person. Um, you'll see a lot of people trying to work at like Google, Netflix, all that good jazz. They might think it's a dream job, but to me, man, I mean, flexibility, you know, good pay, uh, good benefits to certain people. Um, yeah. Remote work is like key buzzwords these days. Everybody want remote work. That just means good lifestyle. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Work-life balance. Um, but yeah, that's what I would say is like a solid, dream job and working at a company that has good culture yeah, yeah that's real something that you can fit in when did you figure out the resume game yeah man i was actually so i went to georgia state um graduated with two degrees one in marketing one in finance uh mega 2020 and before please appreciate that appreciate we that. support black people getting education right, man. appreciate that man appreciate that break this um, through facts so august of 2019 like, I had good internships. I interned at Wells Fargo in 2018. Still and, uh, tell the truth. Nah, I ain't still nobody. Nah, I ain't still nobody. But, and then I interned at Arthur Blanks Foundation at Mercedes Benz Stadium. That's hard. Yeah, and I got like, you know, it was like one out of 14 people that got, well, it was 14 of us, but it was like a thousand applications. So I'm in the top 1%, people that got hired. Um, and then Wells Fargo was pretty much the same dynamic. And people were just asking me, like, how? How you get that job, man? Like, you don't know nobody? Like, you networking? What you doing? I'm like, man, you know, reaching out to people on LinkedIn, you know, being somebody that people want to know. I think that's really what kind of got my foot in the door and just my hunger, you know, um, humbleness, tenacity, just do hard work, do the hard things. But now, nah, man, I think the resume is most definitely important because it's a snapshot of, like, your overall experience. Yeah. And it really tells, like, recruiters and hiring managers, you know, who you are, what you do, and how you plan on bringing value to an organization. Walk me through it. So if I went to sparkyourresume.com right yep. now, what would, what would be the first thing they asked me to do? Yeah, man. So um, our website is kind of pretty built on two goals, like, you know, learning more about who we are, what we do, 
Um, we do like free strategy calls with like career professionals looking to advance their career and then they can purchase like any one of our three packages that we have. Um, so we do like resume enhancement, LinkedIn profile development, cover letter development, and then there's one other thing called reverse recruiting that I'm starting to do to where the job search is more than your resume. Like that's just the beginning of the process. Um, so what we're doing now for clients is like cold emailing recruiters on their behalf, scheduling interviews for them, like applying for jobs on their behalf, pretty much taking out the whole process because most of our clients are like managers, directors, VPs, and C-suite professionals. So they really don't have the time. They're working 40 hours a week, 60 hours a week, but they want a new opportunity or a better opportunity. Bro, I was just sitting here thinking about some crazy shit. Like, I wonder what kind of job you could get just based off your Instagram profile. Like, they depends. no other information, just pictures and captions. You'll be surprised, man. Like, people get jobs off TikTok based on what they're talking about. So, like, if you got good content, like, content is king. If you're talking about, like, really dope stuff and you speak in the language that people want to hear, <laughs> then... I might have to hit you, bro. I was, man, you might can get some money. <laughs> We probably could get some money. I'm no facts. I think y'all should shit. be on LinkedIn, bro, no lie. What is that? So LinkedIn is honestly the number one B2B platform in the world, man. I think, and content, content goes crazy on there, bro. Like video content, polls, like it's a whole science to it, but a lot of, not a lot of like podcasts or like artists You know how to there. Oh yeah, I got like 26,000 on LinkedIn right now. But I ain't on Instagram, like bro, I, I tell people this all the time. I say, if you want to make <laughs> real money, get on LinkedIn. <laughs> that's what the bread is. I swear to God. B2B. And that's social media. Yeah. Like B2B contacts, like CEOs. I'm connected with NFL players on there, CEOs, VC firms, like. And y'all set, set that up for people. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm the whole profile. I need me. Yeah, I might need that, man. Banner, all that. I mean, it I does a lot more. It's just for putting in uh, what you jobs. Call it. Yeah. Yep. That's, that's what most people think. I go to LinkedIn to search for jobs, but nah, man, it's way more than that, man. Like, so I get all my. <laughs> so y'all be having little brunches and lie. shit. No. <laughs> they on there for sure. I'm just saying, I'm not getting on there nah, just for no business now. Nah, 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 it's some hoes in between all the networking, too. <laughs> it's, it's most dead. It's hey, <laughs> all work and no play make you born in the cell and something like that. Fuck that. Nah, they most, they most definitely on there, And what too. was the other one you said? Uh, no, I'm saying, so when you build your LinkedIn profile, it does a lot more to me um, for, like, conversions than, like, an Instagram. So, like, you got a, you got a headshot. Um, you got a cover story, it's like a 30 second like clip that you can put on your headshot when people click on your profile. Like I go to my profile or anybody like look me up on LinkedIn, you'll click my profile and it's a video of me talking about myself. Mm. Instagram, you can't do that. You got like stories that you can probably like people, you know, go through and see stuff like that, but not like a cover story, 30 seconds. I'm telling you who I am, what I do, navigating you to like book a call with my team, like telling you what to do, like guiding you in the right direction to kind of convert you as a, like a prospect or a lead. Um, and then they got like a feature tab on LinkedIn to where you can put like all your, your links to your website, you know, calendar, podcast episodes, all that good jazz, so. Yeah, we're gonna get on there. It honestly converts, man. You'll see a, you a lot of good traffic. Somebody in my um, technical department get us on LinkedIn. LinkedIn? Yeah, yeah. somebody start that right mm -hmm. now. Tell me, bro, go crazy. Roll up and get on LinkedIn. He says, hoes on there and everything. <laughs> 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 no, 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 hey, no, it's social media. That's what you want. He said the vid, the conversion it's rate is crazy over there. It's, it's not just for jobs. <laughs> not just for jobs, bro. It's, it's for blowjobs, too. Hey, 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 hey. I'm, I'm thinking ahead. I'm dead. I'm dead. They're going to steal that slogan because it's dead. too good. I'm it's too dead. good. That is too good to pass up. I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> no, so I'm dead, since you're talking about social media and all of that good stuff, yep. where can they find you? Where can they get in touch with you? How can they support your service? Yep. What we need to do to blow this shit up and take you to the next level? Yeah, man. Um, Instagram is Leander Howard the second, and then you LinkedIn. You just said you wasn't on that. No, I'm on Instagram. I got you an Instagram just profile. Just do other shit. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm more right. focused on LinkedIn though. Like that's yeah. where my audience is for real. Yeah. Yeah. Just like, it probably ain't a lot of Leanders. You just probably yeah for type sure. It in. You type it in, it'll probably. Well, you show. know what I mean. I think LinkedIn is probably like Instagram for people with jobs. Oh, you a fucking genius. I don't even... I mean, mm. I guess you could say that. A lot of corporate professionals are on LinkedIn. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. the influencers be influenced on Instagram, yeah. but it ain't real no tangible gig job thing. But, yeah. Mm. Bro, you cold, though. You cold. You said LinkedIn is Instagram for people who got jobs. I'm dead. <laughs> Keep it real unprofessional on that, too. <laughs>
I'm dead. <laughs> What's your, what, how can they find you on LinkedIn? Yeah, just type in Leander Howard II. Yeah. Tell them how to spell Leander. It's L-E-A-N-D-E-R. <laughs> <laughs> where you from, man? Uh, Stone Mountain. Oh, where? Yeah, born and raised. Went to Arabia Mountain High School. To where? Arabia Mountain. I never heard of Notre it. Oh, just in DeKalb County. Theme school. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I, I was grown when I moved to Georgia. I yeah. didn't go to none of the houses. It sounded mystical. Yeah. I said the Arabia Mountain. What the fuck you graduated with? A Latin of prison thieves? <laughs> nah, that's a good school, man. Um, yeah. It's based on like track, so you get to pick like business or like computer science, like yeah. Well, did you go to the business track? Yep, and I did. It worked yep. out for you. Yeah, it, like, it, 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 it most definitely worked out. Smart, man. Man. I, I believe most of the shit you say. I believe most of it. That's that's I'm a solid, lot. Man, for sure. I mean, you to be a complete stranger, but I know like you got the name Leanne, <laughs> and then you got. Tell them about your software business too. Yeah, man. So uh, so right C man is pretty big. Um, we actually just raised two million seed round. Man. Now what you gonna do with the money? No, <laughs> uh, facts. So yeah, shout out to the founder, Brandon Mitchell, Ahmed, Noel, and Hansel as a CTO. Um, and then Sono, a marketing associate. But what we do at Right See, man, so pretty much spark your resume. Um, the founder had another resume writing business, and we kind of linked up. Like I'm the marketer, he's like the founder, I'm a CMO. And what we do is like it's a management, it's a business management solution for writers and coaches. So we pretty much help people streamline, automate processes, workflows using our software. That's dope. Yeah. But now, man, we're looking to hire and all that stuff now with the two million, um, pay ourselves and things like that, so. Yeah, i will get a job over there. <laughs> I ain't doing shit, but i will be on staff as a consultant. So Bless. raising the two million, because yeah, I think man. most of us out there in the world at the house, we see Shark Tank, and that's yep. our only reference for right. stuff. So how does that go about, like, how much, like, because a lot of times they be on Shark Tank and they ain't proving nothing. So right. just maybe tell the people, like, how you have to prove yourself to right. even be able to get out there like that. Yeah, man, I think, you know, having traction is one thing, like, investors look at. So we already had customers, mm -hmm. uh, paying customers. Like, what was the, I think it was making, like, 200000 a year so far. Um, we just started January 2020. So, um, and a SaaS company, that's... That's pretty major, like, you don't see that a lot. And then pitch decks, so we gotta create a pitch deck. I mean, the founder did most of it, um, but it took us nine months, bro, to raise that two million. We got three three investors, so Collab Capital, they actually located in Atlanta. Uh, we got Atento Capital in Tulsa, and then Bolster is a, like, a, um, I think like a recruiting firm, but we're about to partner with them on like some crazy stuff, but they invested like 100K, and then we got like family and friends around, but I mean, I think just, you know, having that story and then targeting people that can relate to your industry, it makes it a lot easier because they understand what you're doing in business and then selling the vision, man, and having a good team. Like, you got to sell the team because that's one thing they're asking about, who on your team? Because that's, at the end of the day, bro, business is people, systems, and um, processes. <clears throat> so if I'm buying a business, I'm looking at that, right. those three components. Well, shit, drop your social media one more time and let yeah, them know. Yeah, man, uh, follow me on Instagram, Leander Howard II. Um, LinkedIn, most definitely connect with me on LinkedIn, Leander Howard II. Follow Right C, follow Spark Your Resume. Spark Your Resume is the resume writing company, so www.sparkyourresume.com. And then Right C is www.rightc. So it's W R I T E S E A.com. Hey, man. Keep doing yeah, it, man. Thank you, man. We appreciate you, man. Thank you very much, man. The great market is open.